Shalom Madrachim and welcome to Gimel Machana. B'nai Akiva summer camps are part of a big educational picture for your Chanachim, taking them from Judaism's inception on Aleph Machana through Nach on Aleph Chalitzi to early modern Jewish history on Bet Beis, the founding and existence of Medinat Yisrael on Bet Chalitzi through to modern Jewish thought on Gimel Machana. That's you. Your Machana is situated at the end of this journey, which means you'll be learning about Hayyahudi Hadati Ba'olam Madani the orthodox Jew in the modern world. This topic is great and unique because it addresses a range of contemporary issues that are likely to be on your Hanachim's minds. It's all about encouraging them to think in a nuanced way and equipping them with the knowledge to make intellectually honest decisions in the future. In K1, we'll look at identity development and value formation from both a psychological and Torah perspective. In K2, we'll explore questions surrounding pluralism and cross-communalism as we work out if more than one person can be right and how to respond to people whose approach to Judaism we might disagree with. In K3, we'll learn all about modern orthodoxy and its challenges, as well as different approaches to Torah Umada as a hashkafa. In K4, we'll learn all about the landscape of Jewish education and where B'nai Akiva fits into that. In K5, we'll delve into the complexities of being a religious Zionist living in the diaspora and different pillars of this relationship. In K6, we'll look at different Jewish approaches towards gender equality, as well as coming up with practical ways to remove the barriers that both men and women face between them and a connection with Hashem. In K7, we'll learn more about anti-Semitism and its effect on the physical and psychological well-being of Jewish people. In K8, we'll discuss the value of giving and the different ways that one's responsibilities to so can manifest. Finally, in K9, we'll learn all about Hadracha so that we can prepare your Hanachim to become the next generation of Suvah Madrachim in just a couple of months' time. At the end of each Kvitzah, you'll find a list of concrete concepts summarising the main points you want to give over in a fun educational way in Kvitzah. You might also find a couple of Pe'ola ideas if you're struggling to come up with them on your own. If you have any questions about the Chomer, feel free to ask. Good luck!